twin flames are referred to as mirror souls who were previously linked to each other in a previous existence. It is interesting to note that one can also experience the sensation of their twin flames tears. This can be explained by the nature of their deep spiritual and emotional connection. When you are in a twin flame relationship, your energies are perfectly reflected. Which is why you may be able to feel your twin flame's tears. However, it is also possible to sense your twin flame's pain, simply because of the strong connection between the two of you. In a close relationship, it's common to feel another person's emotions without verbal communication. It's believed that when you meet your twin flame, you will always feel their presence across time and space, due to the intense energy between you, Twin flames can sense when the other needs support, even if they are miles apart. Which is why you may feel their pain. Interestingly, your twin flame may not always be crying out for help. You may feel their tears even when they are happy and overwhelmed with positive emotions. When you are with your twin flame, you share an emotional energy that allows you to feel what they are feeling. This means that if one of you experiences happiness, the other will feel happy as well, and if one is sad, the other will feel sad too. This strong emotional connection is unique to twin flames and enables you to sense each other's feelings easily. This type of connection occurs only with someone who has shared a past life and has a deep emotional bond with you. It's not uncommon to feel your twin flame's pain or happiness, even in the present moment. This is because of the intense energy field between twin flames, which intertwines their lives and makes this emotional connection possible. Therefore, finding your twin flame can result in experiencing their emotions in real time. Although this article provides a thorough understanding of why you may feel your twin flame crying, every situation is unique. Therefore, it's highly recommended to seek a personalized reading from a gifted advisor, who can address the specific issues you are facing. However, it's crucial to find a trustworthy advisor to ensure that you receive accurate and helpful guidance. When conversing with your twin flame, they can pick up on your thoughts and feelings, due to the strong connection between twin flames. Although this occurrence is not always the case, it's possible when one twin flame experiences an emotional trigger. Twin flames share a soul-level connection that ensures they have always been together and will never be apart from each other. They are soul mates in every sense, appearing in each other's dreams and communicating in subtle ways. While this type of communication is more subtle than telepathy, it's still possible to sense each other's emotions. Therefore, if your emotional trigger causes your twin flame to feel upset, you may be able to sense their happiness or sadness. Twin flames primarily communicate through dreams, where they can sense the emotions and thoughts of their counterpart. Communication can take the form of visions, feelings, or intuition, and is often non-verbal due to the depth of their connection. Twin flames may experience sadness and pain when they dream of being separated from each other, but they can also feel joy and peace when they share beautiful dreams. Twin flames dreams are often similar because their souls align with each other, and they may have the same dream for several consecutive nights to signify their continued connection. The ability to feel your twin flames crying is not immediate, and may take some time to develop. At the beginning of your relationship, when you first meet, the connection between you and your twin flame can be overwhelming and new. It can be difficult to focus on your emotions and become connected to someone you have never met before. Although the intensity of your emotions for each other is unlike anything you've ever felt before, your twin flame may not yet be able to identify the feelings they are experiencing. It may take time for them to understand what is happening and how to respond to your distress. Therefore, it is important to be patient and give them time to process their emotions. After a few weeks, your emotional connection with your twin flame is likely to become more stable and consistent. 
as you both get to know each other better, gradually, you will begin to understand the meaning of your emotions and how they relate to your twin flame. The reason why you can feel each other's emotions so strongly is that your soul was split into two and one part stayed with your twin flame while the other became you. This is the foundation of the twin flame theory. According to Plato's story, people used to be born with two heads and four arms and legs but were split in two by God because they were too powerful. Now, when twin flames reunite, they become powerful entities that can conquer anything, and the connection between them is so profound, because they are finding the missing piece of their soul. Is it true that you're not whole without this person? No, that is not true. Even without your twin flame, you are still a complete and whole person. While your twin flame may add something special to your life, they do not define your worth or completeness. The idea of finding your other half can be dangerous if taken too literally, as it can lead to unhealthy patterns of codependency. It is important to remember that you are capable of living a fulfilling life on your own, and that relying solely on another person for happiness can lead to toxic behaviors. Instead, it is essential to break those patterns and learn how to be happy independently. Will the twin flame connection persist even after separation? The twin flame connection is incredibly strong and to some extent, it will continue even after separation. It's important to remember that the connection is to your soul, not your physical body, so it will still exist even if you are not together. However, the nature of the connection will be different, but it's still a positive thing as you can learn to be happy on your own. You may still sense your twin flame's thoughts and feelings like a ghostly connection, even if you're apart for the rest of your life. Deliberately shutting off your energy from your twin flame is not a healthy solution, as it can cause you to cut off your energy from everything else as well. Instead, it's better to accept the connection and find ways to make the most of it even when you're separated. The longer you spend apart, the weaker the connection may become. Whether or not you should reach out to your twin flame when you sense that they are crying depends on your unique journey. If you are together with them, you can offer support, but it's essential to respect your boundaries. Even if you know they are crying, you don't have to feel obligated to reach out if you are not emotionally ready to offer support. Boundaries are critical, especially for twin flames, as their lives are intertwined. During a twin flame separation, reaching out to them is optional. If you want to use the situation as an opportunity to reconnect, you can reach out, however, be aware that after a twin flame separation, your twin may not be interested in speaking with you while they are crying. Rest assured, even though twin flame relationships are known for their intensity, you will eventually become accustomed to them, and things will start to feel more familiar and effortless. In the meantime, keep cultivating your curiosity, communicating with your twin flame, and acquiring more knowledge. While you should now have a good grasp of how twin flames can sense each other's emotions, speaking with a talented advisor can provide you with even more clarity on the matter.